Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. I posted a video back in April of this year, 2021, that Google was adding a memories page to Google Chrome, and that was Google Chrome Canary, to let you ultimately manage your web activity a lot better. And basically, memories was a flag that we uh, enabled in Google Chrome Canary, uh, which dedicated a page that provided all your web activity in one place. Now this is just a quick update video to that first video and the memories flag now has received a little bit of update where you now get a journeys tab uh, instead of a memories page in your history page in Google Chrome Canary. Now currently in the stable version of Google Chrome which is version 94 this is currently what your history page looks like in Google Chrome the stable version. Now if we just head over to Google Chrome Canary, which as many of you know is a pre-release version used for testing and experimenting. If we now apply the same flag memories as I mentioned in that first video, and to do this we head up to our Omnibox, our address bar, and we enter chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags, and in the search we enter memories, and the flag now says enables Chrome history journeys and that's for Mac, Windows, Linux, Chrome OS and Android and then we change it from default and now you can see there's a lot of other options it's not just standard enabled it looks like you can limit the amount of uh, entries now in the history page using this new journeys tab but I'm just going to go for the enabled the default enabled option uh, for this uh, video and we relaunch Chrome Canary to apply that flag and now if we head over to our history section in Google Chrome Canary, you will see now that Journeys has been added to the history page on the left hand side. And now uh, instead of loading a separate page called Memories, which I mentioned in that first video, that's no longer uh, available. And all of, it's of the contents that we found in uh, the Memories page are now grouped into Journeys, the Journeys page. And although at the moment I can't see any tab groups and other cards that were there in the original uh, video I posted, but at this stage it looks like it's a new way of grouping your browser activity based on keywords or other related data. And if we just scroll down here, you can also see it gives you how many days ago you visited that particular site or a feature. And you can see here, um, it also gives you some uh, several uh, sub items, some sub uh, sub menus to the actual grouping uh, in journeys as well. But this is still early days, and obviously this is in Google Chrome Canary, and this is a brand new feature, which looks like they are trying to obviously collate things now into journeys uh, in the Google Chrome Canary history page. And as I say, this is still early days, so this is there's still a lot of development to be done here, and I will keep you uh, posted on developments regarding this new feature as I get more information and I will leave a link to that first video I posted uh, regarding memories in Google Chrome Canary uh, down below if you are interested just to give you a little bit, little bit more information into what this is actually all about. So I just want to let you know memories flag in Google Chrome Canary now pops journeys which just kind of collates everything into one place and gives you a little bit more information regarding your history and visited sites. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.